Oh, look at that. Oh, hey my friends, it's me Handyman How. Hope you're doing absolutely awesome today. Look at that. <laughs> We're here in Patriots Point and that is the USS Yorktown. <laughs> oh, we're gonna learn all about it today. Come on, let's go check it out. <laughs> we're gonna learn all about it today. Come on, let's go. This is the USS Yorktown aircraft carrier. It served the United States Navy and was built in only 16 and a half months. It is 888 feet long and it weighs 30,000 tons. Look at this, my friends. Oh, oh, you know what this is? This is the captain's bridge. <laughs> and this is where the captain would stand to command his ship. Oh, and look, look at the view. He can see everything from up here. Yep, there's windows all the way around. That way the captain can see everything that's going on. Even on the flight deck below where all the planes are. <laughs> that is amazing. Of course, they've got all these amazing controls and switches in here. Oh, check this out. This, this is a radar. It tells the captain what other ships are out in the ocean. <laughs> That's really neat. Oh, and of course they gotta know where the, the direction that they're going. So they get to use this. It's a built-in compass right into the ship. Well, see, look, we've got west, we've got south and east. And this special symbol, that's for north. <laughs> wow, this is amazing. Oh, could you see yourself riding in this ship and having a beautiful view of the ocean? <laughs> oh, there's some more special parts of the captain's bridge. Come on, let's go. Oh, wow. Look at this chair. Oh, looks really comfy. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, this is great. Oh, I can spin around and see all kinds of stuff. Oh, what's that? Some really awesome ships down there. <laughs> oh, so the captain had all kinds of crew members that would sit in these awesome captain chairs. <laughs> oh, and they would be lookouts all around the captain's bridge and keep the captain notified of everything that's happening. <laughs> oh, this is great. I could get used to this. <laughs> wow, this is amazing. Oh, come on. We've got some more to check out. That was neat. Oh. Wow, look at this room. I like this one. You know what this room is called? This is called the pilot house. And this is where crew members would steer this gigantic ship oh, from right here. Oh, look at this. This is called the helm. And this is where they would steer the ship. Oh, their names were helmsmen. Oh yeah, and they got to use this gigantic wheel that operated the rudders on the back of the ship. So whenever they turn this wheel to the left, the rudders would move to steer the ship to the left. Okay, when they move it to the right, <laughs> it moves the rudders to steer the ship to the right. Oh, they had all these gauges they got to use. Oh, and this, this is a control panel. Yep, and it helps to communicate with the crew members down below in the engine room what needs to happen to the engine. All these knobs and controls on here. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yep. And it would tell the crew members down below what to do with the engines. Maybe speed them up, slow them down. Had two engines on the ship. Maybe speed one up and slow the other one down. <laughs> this is really awesome. <laughs> they have a really important job. Oh, wow, this is neat. <laughs> it's like I'm the helmsman of this ship. Where to, Captain? Yeah, to the left. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. This is great. Have you ever wondered 
what it's like steering a gigantic aircraft carrier. <laughs> oh, and you know, there's a really important way that all the crew members communicated. Check this out. <laughs> Look, it's telephones. <laughs> they have them everywhere, but not just any telephones. They are sound powered telephones. So just by the sound of your voice is what powers them. So no electricity, no telephone lines, just by the sound of your voice. That's really amazing. Oh, well, let's go check out some more. Come on, let's go. This is great. You can see everything from up here. <laughs> oh, check this out. <laughs> We're on one of the observation decks up top. <laughs> we can see all kinds of things up here. Oh, even that. <laughs> can you see that? <laughs> that is one of the destroyers that sails along with this aircraft carrier. No ship would sail along. And of course, this ship had to have some protection. And that's what a destroyer ship was for. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, and look, it's the flight deck. This is where the airplanes would take off and land. They have all kinds of different airplanes on there. I think we should go check it out. Come on, let's go. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Oh, it's really windy out here. Do you know why? Because we're on the flight deck. This is where airplanes would take off and land right here on this carrier in the middle of the ocean. Planes like this behind me. Look at this. This is an F-18 Hornet. Oh, oh, it's flown by the Blue Angels. <laughs> wow, isn't this amazing? Oh, it's a piece of history here. Oh, this is amazing. These airplanes could go up to a thousand miles per hour oh, and could climb 50,000 feet in the air. Oh, wow, that's really high. Oh, you know, it must have took a lot of practice to learn how to land this on this carrier. <laughs> well, of course, you got to have some really good landing gear. Look, look, there it is. There's one up front here and there's two in the back. <laughs> oh, and look. Can you see up there? <laughs> Look at this. It's the air intake for the engine. <laughs> wow. You know, these planes had a lot of really awesome parts like the wings and the stabilizers. Come on, let's go look at those. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at this. <laughs> it's painted blue. One of my favorite colors. <laughs> this is amazing. Ooh. Well, they do have a lot more planes. Come on, let's go check them out. <laughs> Look at this, my friends. <laughs> oh, every airplane that landed on this carrier had to have this on the back of the airplane. This is a tail hook and would help the airplane stop on the carrier. It would fly in and this tail hook would grab a hold of this. This is an arresting cable. Oh, oh, and there were six of them. Ever the airplane would fly in, it would attach to one of those six cables. And oh, it's really heavy. Oh, I guess it probably needs to be really heavy and tight and secure and strong to stop these airplanes. It's really cool. Wow, look at this helicopter. Oh, this is awesome. This is the Sea King helicopter. Oh, look at those blades. They're long. Oh, and look, it even has rescue on the side. That's right. You know, these aircraft carriers had really important jobs to do. Even while they're in the ocean, they would use helicopters for rescues. Oh, even for astronauts. Yeah, astronauts. They got finished with their mission in space and had to come back to Earth. 
they landed in the water, they would use this helicopter and these aircraft carriers to go and pick them up. <laughs> wow, that's really interesting, right? Oh yeah, oh, can you see? <laughs> see the rescue signs? Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> Ooh, do you see that one? Oh, we've got to check that one out. Come on, let's go. Oh, wow, look at this. <laughs> this is an F-14 Tomcat. <laughs> supersonic jet. It can get up to 1,500 miles per hour. That's really fast. Ooh, and it can climb to 56,000 feet in height. Oh, wow. It's really fast and really high. Oh, this is an amazing aircraft. Look, right up there, it's the cockpit. That's where the pilot would sit. Oh, and look. It's the intake. Oh, look at this. Wow. Can you see inside there? Look, it's one of the engines. Oh, this jet, this airplane has two engines. Come on, let's go check it out. Oh, oh, oh wow. Come on back here. The wings, the stabilizers. Oh, look at this. Look, it's the back of the engine. Oh, one of the engines, there's one here, and there's one here. Oh, these engines are gigantic. Oh, of course, probably have to have some really big engines to go 1,500 miles per hour. Oh, wow. Oh, and look, it's the tail hook. Oh, yep, that's how the F-14 would stop on the aircraft carrier. Oh, wow, this is really amazing. Oh, I wonder what it was like to fly one of these things. the belly of the Yorktown. You know where we're at? We're in the engine room. Oh, wow. And this is where all of the crew members would operate the engine. Oh, look at all of these gauges. Oh, and look, right here. You see, this looks really similar to the operation panel in the pilot house where the helmsman would tell the engineers down here in the engine room about the engine. Oh, wow. Look at all of these valves. Oh, I mean, look at them. There's one here, there's one here, there's one here. Oh, there's a gigantic one here. Oh, there's tiny ones here. Oh, they're all over the place. Oh, you know, I bet it took a lot of training to learn about all of these valves. And all of these valves help control the engine. Oh, wow. Let's see. Here we go. Let's speed up the engines. Oh, wait, wait, no. We need to turn this valve on. <laughs> to let some steam out right there. Oh, look at that gauge. We need to do this one. Yep. <laughs> oh no, this one right here. Let's see. Yep, that works. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. This is so much fun. this one right above my head oh, yep that works let's see yep nail this one <laughs> oh, wow it's getting really loud in here I think we might need to call the captain's bridge oh, I know the perfect spot so when it got really really loud in the engine room they would come to this spot the phone booth look Here's the phone. <laughs> and they can call up top to the captain's bridge. <laughs> oh, yes sir, captain, right on it. <laughs> oh, that's great. It's like they had their own telephone booth in the engine room. <laughs> wow, this is a really cool door. <laughs> oh, let's close it back. Oh, wow. Ah, 
That's really neat. Oh, wow, look. I have a barber shop <laughs> right here on the ship. Well, you know, there are over 3,000 crew members and you are at sea a pretty long time. So if you need a haircut or a trim, they've got that. Oh, and they have a post office, just in case you need to send some mail. Oh, they even have a doctor's office, in case you get sick. They even have a dentist office to fix your teeth. <laughs> wow, it's almost like your own floating town in the middle of the ocean. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, might need a little trim. <laughs> It's the ready room. Oh, you know pilots would come in here and sit down and get ready for their flight <laughs> and get instructed on how they need to fly, where they need to fly. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, hey my friends. Welcome to the machine shop. That's right, here on the Yorktown it has its own machine shop. You want to check it out? Come on. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> this place is amazing. <laughs> I feel right at home with all this machinery. <laughs> Some really awesome stuff. <laughs> Look. Look how gigantic a drill bit is. <laughs> and they had some really amazing machinery like this. This is like a drill. Ooh. And look, they had a really special system throughout the ship to get the parts from point A to point B. Right here, they had pulleys and winches and this yellow beam that went all throughout the ship. And that's how they would move the parts from place to place. <laughs> it's awesome. Ooh, look at this one. <laughs> look at this drill bit. Oh, now that is gigantic. <laughs> Oh wow, this place is awesome. I could work here all day long. <laughs> oh look, it looks like it's dinner time. Are you hungry? Oh, ooh, I am. This is what it would look like whenever you came to get fed. Oh, oh, the crew members would feed breakfast, lunch, and dinner to over 3,000 crew members. Oh, hey there, oh, I think I'll take a biscuit and some turkey. Oh, and especially the chocolate chip cookie. Oh, wow, look at this, this is great. Oh, wow. Oh, my friends, we've had such an absolutely awesome day here at the USS Yorktown at Patriots Point. We got to check out some really awesome planes and find out how the ship operates. It was amazing. Oh, and there's so much more things to do here on the USS Yorktown. Well, thanks for watching Handyman How. Got some more stuff to check out. See you later. <laughs>